I'm going to teach you how to tie the orange claw dad today. Very simple fly. It's probably one of the number one flies in Virginia for large and smallmouth bass. This one just happens to be an orange. All materials you can pick up from Urban Angler except for the hooks. Let me show you how to what you need. So size four fly shack hooks. Eastern Trophies brand laser cut claw dad claws. Variegated orange chenille and medium orange rubber legs. So I'm going to start by taking my hook and there's already a hole in the claw dad claw. I'm just going to put that through. Now there's other ways to tie it. This is the way I tie it. This is the uh, silk 12 watt thread. You can see how gossamer it is if it even shows up. It's made by a company called Semper Fly out of England. You can pick it up through Cascade Crest Tools. Start your thread and then just wrap your claw down. Go back up towards the eye. I'm going to be using a medium lead eye today. And you want to have it, you know, about a sixth of the way back from the actual fly eye. No need to glue. It should stay in place. Okay. That's, the gap is about twice the diameter of the actual chenille. This is the chenille. I'm going to cut about six or seven inches. Bring my thread back down here. Start my thread, wrap up, and just start gently wrapping. I'm tying this one. We've been seeing a lot of orange crayfish in Potomac this week, a lot of orange and red ones. Now we're almost done. We need to flip the fly over. The reason I'm using the regal hook, regal vise, is those hooks don't move. So you take this here orange, and I've already separated out about 12 strands. And what I want to do is measure it about the length of the hook, cut that. I'm going to keep these all together. Put it down with a little bit sticking out in front of the eyes. And just give it a bunch of really solid wraps. Gonna wrap behind it a little bit. Now I'm just gonna whip finish. It's not an instructional video on how to whip finish, so I'm not gonna explain what I'm doing, just whip finishing. I've been using this thread for a week now. It's awesome. Cascade Crest Tools. All right, cut the thread. And now how to make it splay out? Well, just kind of Kind of grab it and put it up top, a little easier to see. Just take these pieces and just pull on them. You can take markers and mark up the claw dad if you want, but that's basically the fly right there. Orange claw dad. Enjoy.